Well, in this clip, I'll be finishing uh, the pipes, and uh, here you can see one of the small uh, pipes that's a uh, uh, top a uh, high uh, D with its uh, stopper made and its a uh, bit of chamois leather around the edge of the uh, stopper its uh, upper lip and bottom block plate in place Sorry. and there uh, I showed in the previous uh, clip I'd made a long strip of wood with a section gouged out with my router that long strip has been cut into small slices which I've glued onto the back of the pipes and now what I need to do is to drill through the wind chamber and through the back of the uh, pipe in order to finish the piece so um, uh, here goes I'm going to remove the uh, band that's been holding the bits together the rubber band the plate and a little gasket from uh, inside and I'm getting ready to drill and uh, in order to position my pipe so that I can drill the hole I'm going to start the drill spinning <coughs> so I start the drill spinning it's easy to see the position of the drill so I stop it if I stop it because of the cuts in the drill it's very difficult to see looking one way and the other whether it's centered Whereas if I now place the drill above a nice piece of bare board and then I spin the bit, the optical illusion of having a complete tube enables me to check right. it's nice and centered all round. Now I'm going to hold that firmly and just uh, gently bring down the drill head very gently letting the drill do all the work feel what's happening in the wood with my fingers no pressure no pushing just allowing the drill to go down on its own and using my ears I can hear what's happening and using my fingers I can feel what's happening I'll know when the pipe has gone through the baseboard getting through there and there's a slight movement in the base and so now I know that I'm right through so I can let the drill come back up slowly switch it off remove the baseboard remove the pipe <coughs> blow away all the dust <coughs> excuse me and there you can see a nice clean hole in the back uh, of the pipe and right through the wind uh, chamber of the uh, pipe and so uh, now I can replace the uh, various parts of the pipe the little gasket cut out of a thin piece of cardboard goes on top the lower cap pipe cap goes on top and for the moment I haven't voiced my pipes so everything remains stuck on with rubber bands so that uh, it can be moved before gluing so the bits of the pipe are together and the last uh, operation will involve taking uh, a pipe cutter good quality a pipe cutter for neat, uh, uh, neat uh, cuts and cutting small lengths for the smaller pipes I'm using about 22 uh, mil uh, lengths cutting small lengths of pipe to insert in the uh, back hole or um, brass pipe and so the pipe will clip onto its board and the hosing from the hosing from the tracker bar will plug in on the back here and that little pipe is just pushed in here flush with the uh, back plate in order to complete the project the uh, pipe uh, the tube here the tubing will be glued in with uh, crystal araldite and that will be a complete pipe all 20 are done and uh, now if I just straighten up the, the cap on the top I can once again blow in it so 
So that's one of 20 pipes ready to roll. Next clip coming soon. Thanks for watching. And here's the uh, the big B pipe, D pipe that is uh, two octaves lower that's been done as well. And I want to blow that for you. I don't know how the recording will sound, but uh, have a listen to the deep D. Pipe remaining to be tested against the against the bellows once they're completed. And here you can see the full set of pipes from uh, behind with the small bracket that's been made to attach them to the pipe board and the brass uh, attachment, the brass nipple to which the air tube will be inserted running directly from each of the pipes to the tracker bar on the organ. One more or less complete set of pipes with the three base pipes still waiting as John Smith says in his instructions waiting to be mitered but mitered in the organ so that the dimensions can be made to fit the organ as uh, built.